on queens we are back this time i'm excited to try out a washing up with this gel i wonder how my hair will look only this product because even though it's some things i don't like about it there's a lot of things that i do like about it and so that is what we are going to be doing today so i do want to tell you guys what i use before i start the wash and go to wash my hair, um, well I co-wash this time around and I use the As I Am Olive and Tea Tree Oil line. I use the co-wash, I use the Tea Tree Conditioner, I use this as a deep conditioner. And it also has an oil to this line which is probably behind me somewhere. I use it as a hot oil treatment but you can use it as a daily moisturizer or a sealer. And yeah, that is what I use to wash my hair. And for my leave-in conditioner, I went with the Cantu Shea Butter for Natural Hair Leave-In Conditioning Cream. So yeah, that is what we are using today. I already have my sections. I am ready to go. And I hope y'all are ready to watch. <laughs> Alright, so we are going to start in the back. Alright, so here we go. Spray and spray and spray. Yes, we need to get that wet. And I'm gonna massage it in. Alright, so I'm gonna have to go in with a good amount because this dries fast. But um, if that happens, then I'm just going to re wet it. So, yeah, I'm gonna start with a section like this. Doesn't feel like it's any gel right here. I don't want to be here all day, but I want this washing go to come out the way I think it will come out because this product I think can give me a, the washing go. That gel, it, it makes me have like a finger wave look. That is crazy.
All right, Queen. So it's about, I would say, 85% dry. It's still like wet by the roots. So I'm just going to show you guys what it's looking like. They got a bounce. So that's a good thing. But I am eating some shrinkage. And I've been eating. But I am about to use my blow dry just on a cool temperature. Hey, Queen. So I'm back to show you guys the final look. And I do like how it looks. I did use my blow dryer towards the end because in my roots it was still wet. So I'm like, listen, it's time for me to get this dry because it's getting late. So I did use my blow dryer and also stretched it out a little bit. And I did go outside to also let the humidity do a little something, something to it. But I don't know. I don't know if the humidity did too much to it. Um, It is like real muggy and sticky out there. So... I thought that maybe I can get like something from the humidity, but I guess um, this show, listen, it's going to take some time before I get through. So other than that, like I like the gel, like I said at the beginning, I don't like that it gets hard really fast, and I also don't like the smell a little bit, you know, but I can get used to that. So let me show you guys the back. So I wanted to get on here right quick to show you guys what second day is looking like. Listen, this is my best wash and go for real. Like, I am like loving this wash and go. And I think I have found the solution. You know what I'm saying? I found the solution. So yeah, this is second day. My curls is still defined. Let me show you guys what the back is looking like. Yeah, queens, that is how my wash and go is looking. Listen, this gel, this gel, I even had Ab um, take a look at this gel just to make sure that it wasn't a man gel. He smelled it and everything. He said, yeah, it smells like something that he has in like his deodorant or something. He was like comparing the smells. But I was like, you sure this is not a man gel? He's like, well, it doesn't say it, but it does smell like it. But I like it a lot. Like, if my wash and go is going to come out like this all the time, like, with this gel, because he even said it, he was like, um, and this is a man talking about wash and go. He ain't even got no hair. <laughs> so he was like, yeah, maybe you should try it a second time before you get too excited. So I am going to try it out again. Um just to see if I get the same result. And I think I'm going to be wearing it tomorrow too. Like, I'm going to wear it as long as it lasts. But yeah, queens, I, I wanted to come on here and show you guys what it was looking like. Um, I don't know if it's going to get bigger or not. I think that's going to take like another two days because uh, I went outside yesterday. And it seemed like the humidity didn't do anything to my hair. So this might take a while. Hey, queens, so it's day four. I'm about to go to work. And look at my hair. It is still holding up. This like wash and go can really last, I would say like seven days. Now on the seventh day, it might start to look a little frizzy because I do have some frizz. Yeah, my curls are still like popping. Like, we're like, this is what I'm going to be using for my wash and goes from now on. I think that this gel, just with like something moisturizing underneath, is perfect for me. My hair is not um, not hard, not hard at all. You know, it has softness, it has bounce to it. It might look hard, but it's not hard at all. Like it has moisture, it has shine. This thing gives you shine too. Like so, queens. This is day four. I'm not quite sure if I'm gonna come back for day five because I got other things I need to take care of. I got other styles on my mind, and yeah, I've been going already for a little while, and I need to get these styles out for you guys so if i don't see you tomorrow i guess i will see you 